Garceau. Was that last night? enough trouble for one night. Fine. I'll procure my wine in some other fashion. Hello guys, Kedger, and in bottom of the barrel we are back in Versailles. And uh, before we can steal some wine we have to lure five gods, or maybe four gods, with the sherry bomb. So I started off with this first one right here. There's also one in the back there as you can see, and then there's three to the left. And there is someone inside the house as well. Uh, I'm using using my chair bombs before that. We'll try to use it on the three guards that are standing together, but one of them saw me. When I killed the uh, first guy, he will just stand there for a while. I just want him to go back to the two others, so I can take all of them with one. Then we can uh, continue with the wine. Obviously don't have to, but to complete all the challenges, it's, uh, it's nice to complete them as soon as possible. But if I jump over this fence, I don't think he will turn towards me now. Then I can stand behind here and throw a chair bomb over the fence. And all the three of them will go towards it. And that's the first challenge completed. Now I just have to get around here and take out this guy. Because he's kind of in the way. And the wine is actually in this building. So we can, I can get up in here. And there's some windows on both sides of the house. Which can take us out. No, not out, but in to the wine. This is actually the wrong window. We're balcony to get in. I didn't know what I th thought, but maybe I could have got, gone through here, but no, you can't. But there's a this chest. So at least something nice were it were in here. And I just have to get out on the balcony again and go to the correct balcony. You can actually peek lock into the room, but if you jump into this, bal this balcony, you don't have to do that. But if you come from the other side, you have to go through the door. And you can see the one, but there's actually two guys in here. So... I just wanted to get them out of the way. It doesn't really matter, because when you take the wine, you will go back to somewhere else. the first flashback he had from last night. Now let's go to the brasserie where we took the wine. And uh, maybe the watch is there. Damn, mm, 
It's not far over here. <clears throat> I'm talking about La Douche. Just wanna get this. This out of the way. To complete the crowd events because you get lots of money or something special from completing them. So here we are. Oh Christ. Not you again. Didn't do enough damage last night. No, I, I just... My father's watch. Have you seen it? I see nothing. Might want to ask one of the four men you picked a fight with. Idiot. Watch it! You don't want to do that, boy. Piss off, old man. So we have to do the fight he did last night. And that is just fighting against these ones until you get uh, until you get beaten. Because that's apparently what happened. So it's not really that hard to con uh, fight with him. Except for that big guy. <laughs> but I think when you die or something, you will... Whoa, that swing. I don't know, you will be getting hit by a chair anyways, I don't know how. You. Uh, where's your boss? Oh, shit. No. Get back here. So, we have to just chase down this guy that worked with the. Uh, that were, uh, were there last night, maybe? Or at least were with the guys that took the watch. But it's fairly easy to take him down. Where? The palace! Palace. Thank you. <laughs> so we are back at the palace in Versailles. And the second challenge is to use to get two poison kills. And to do that, we have to unlock the poison smoke before we can get to the gang leader. And um, to do this, we have to throw two poison smokes at the two same people because they won't die from just one unless they are damaged from the from earlier. So now I just wanted to get them to get back to towards each other and they do and they can use the second uh, um, poison smoke I have and they will both die and the challenge will be completed I just say it with the first two because I don't know there will be more people after a while but I mean there will be more spread out and more of them so it might not be that easy, but those two first ones, those are really easy. Now, these are standing in very great positions. Just by the window, I won't uh, see anything that happens. And then there are four more over here. Two that's standing by the window and one to the right and one that walks around this desk here. So we're actually back at the palace where we were when Elise's um, party was in the beginning of the game. 
exactly the same way we walked. Walked back then. We have to walk right now. Until the place where they went into a room and then... We, I don't know, maybe... Yeah, it's uh, kind of the same. When we went to see Monsieur de la Serre get killed. And here is the famous corner kill. Cover assassination in Assassin Unity. Assassin's Creed Unity. Doesn't matter if my medicine is low. These are way too easy to kill. And now we just have to keep running around her. Mm, and <laughs> the eagle vision. It's not doing so well when you hang over apparently. Well, here we are closing in and there's two more guys. Right there. Before we go downstairs to continue the quest for the gang leader. One. I couldn't shoot him for some reason. I don't even have my pistol on me. <laughs> Stupid me. At least he comes towards me. Because we don't have most of the equipment right here. Luckily the other guy turned around. So we just go in and kill him. Because there's no one else up here. But now we will go downstairs. There's more people down. And also the gang leader is downstairs. So this is where we were in that mission. Now I need I need a double assassination on these two guys down here for the easiest way of executing them without getting into any trouble. Oh yeah! So there's three of them here. Should be able to take it out without being seen because the other two are standing on the other side. Uh, one is just looking at the drawers, and the other one, I think he will turn, yeah, he will turn around. He will see me, well, both of them will see me, but only one will investigate, luckily enough. That will just stand by the drawers. But this guy will come over and die, and then we can just easily pick out the other one. Then we can continue once more. The hunt for the gang leader and the watch. Is that me? Looks like it. So I couldn't do a corn cover assassination on that guy, but whatever, because the other one is standing on. Then I look in the other way into this bookshelf. And here we are, where... Of... No. Maybe not. Maybe that's the... Isn't that where the, um, our father died? Hmm. Maybe. But here's the gang leader, and we just have to kill him and loot him. And um, here's one guy walking after him, and this guy. Then we can go for him, because the other guys will not, not even look at us. This is the easiest way I found, and we are done with this then. So, I'll see you guys later. Bye bye. -bye. Oh no.
You look like hell. You look like you want something from me. That's a fine thing to say after you up and vanished. You made it fairly clear you no longer required my services. Don't. Don't you dare talk to me like that. What do you expect me to say, Elise? Forgive me for not letting you die? I'm sorry that I care more about you than about killing Germain. I thought we wanted the same thing. What I wanted was you. I can't bear the fact that my carelessness got your father killed. Everything I've done since then has been to fix that mistake and to prevent it from happening again. You must have come here with something in mind. What was it? Paris is tearing itself apart. Germain has driven the revolution to new heights of depravity. The guillotines operate nearly around the clock now. And what do you expect me to do about it? The Arno I love wouldn't have to ask that question. You're better than this. I'm going back to Paris. Are you coming? There's one last thing I need to do. All right. I'll go see to our transportation. Stay out of trouble. Don't get caught. <laughs>